Uh, All right. So this is the match. I apologize so much for that, guys. My first epic fail of these tournaments. All right. So where were we? You guys get to pick up where I'm leaving off here. Okay, Moore going down to about 50% life, but going right back up. He seems to be taking a lot of damage, but managing to survive it all. The healing is really good on his team right now. And as you can see, the Beastmaster pet is back up and on Morg. So the max DPS from Nephi is being applied to Morg right now. Duala C-seat off to the side now. Ganked, been squirreled. Revert, making sure that the Dom CCs are flowing nicely. Morgan Neffy seeming to have a one-on-one -on -one match going on over here. Whereas the other team, uh, the other members of the teams are out there on the sidelines doing their casting from afar. Not much melee in this match like we've been seeing in much of the matches before. More sitting around the 80 to 70 percent mark right now. Everybody seems to be healed up though. Besides him, Nephi went down for a little bit there, but went right back up. So the DPS is seeming to have kind of broke off some. I imagine the Dom draining is being a big factor in this matchup right now. Revert CC'd now, but no real pressure is being applied just yet. They may be trying to build up their cooldowns once again for a big burst, or the draining is causing this to draw out more than before. It seems to uh, everybody is pretty much at full life except for Nephi going a little bit almost well almost down to about 60% there but seemed to go right back up and Morg also taking a little bit of damage but so far nobody in danger of their lives. Both Morgan and Nephi seem to be taking a little bit of damage, but it's not too much just yet. Oh, Morg just got bursted onto right fast there. He went down to about 30% life, but went right back up. It was a moment of panic I'm sure he had right there as the DPS stacking was done very abruptly. And the two minute warning has been given and there was one death on Testy Festy which was Morg so if it does go to time limit Testy Festy will lose.
<laughs> Should you link the straw poll again? Duala taking a lot of damage there. Oh, look at the pressure being put on the Duala. Oh, it goes down. Duala is down. Revert taking a lot of damage right now, and he is down as well. So that is a 1-0 win for Team Warlord Sucks. All right, the next round here is underway. Morg being CC'd right off the bat. Morg seems to be sticking on to Nephi right now. Ganked being squirreled, and Nephi seems to be sticking to the Beastmaster build. The DPS from it is, I guess, up to his standards because he continues to run it and continues to do well with it. Ganked CC'd now. They seem to be sticking around the pillar so that they can do the kiting as they need to. Duala seems to be using the pillow, to, uh, the pillar to great effect right now. Revert was getting a lot of casting in, so they decided to CC. Oh, Duala going down really fast there. Managed to get healed all the way up to about full, but yeah, that was a moment of panic, I'm sure. Nephi putting a lot of damage on the Duala right now, whereas Morg is trying to stop Nephi from applying so much pressure. Is it, oh, it's, uh, it's nerf shots running the Beastmaster, huh? I can't look at the buffs right now, so I wasn't sure. I know Nephi is really well known for running Beastmaster often, uh, particularly in his PvE guides, so I figured it was him. I did not know that nerf shot was the one running the Beastmaster spec. I guess my assumptions were wrong. Beastmaster pet still being put on the Duala. Whoa, look at the DPS being applied there. So if Nephi is running the Paragon spec right now, he's probably running the 61 Paragon to stack the the uh, finisher onto people so that it stacks with shifting blades and does a massive amount of damage. The Reaping Harvest. As the Paralord spec is really well but it seems to be more catered towards Warfront performance rather than absolute amazing bursts like the 61 paragon provides right now specifically for a a matchup like this the 3v3 the 61 paragon is is an excellent choice for this not sure if that's what he's using but Whoa, look at the damage being put on the Duala right now. Wow. How is he able to survive that for so long? He was he was hovering around the 20 to 10 percent range for a long time there. Oh, the damage has been switched on to Nephi, and Nephi went down really fast there. As soon as Revert got out of his CC, he applied CCs to the other team immediately, doing a very good job of playing the Dom spec there.
spammable sleep is very good match there but of course nerf shot is stuck in the pillar unfortunately poor nerf shot the match has to be reset wow and charging right in is ganked and getting the automatic squirrel right off the bat Neffy CC'd in the back lines there, but getting a charge into Revert. A lot of pressure being put onto Revert. I think they are very aware that Revert is causing a lot of problems for their team. The burst is being restricted by the Dom's... CCN and energy draining. Revert still taking a lot of damage. He's doing a good job of kiting, but the BM pet is on him as well as all of the DPS from the opposite team. Morg seems to be focused on applying some of pressure to Nephi, but he seems to be getting great heals and also shielded up as well. Nerf shot CC'd off to the side there. Revert still the focus of all the damage here. Going down to about 50% life, but getting a large shield being put on him. The match is taking a little bit of a stall. I imagine they're waiting on cooldowns to be brought back up. That way they can pick their target and burst as needed. Revert still being the focus of a lot of damage. He keeps on hovering between the 80% to 40-30% range. He's just taking so much pressure right now. They clearly do not like the Dom being actively casting off to the side without interruption. Revert able to survive because... He's getting help from his team. Morg is doing a really good job of trying to take a little bit of the pressure off him. But he's getting really low right now. Revert is about 30% health right now. It goes back up to about 60-70% range and back up to about 90% now. He is definitely taking so much burst damage that at any moment he could go down. It seems that his team is there right at the right time to save him right whenever you think he's about to go down. He's about healed all the way up now so he could get a little more offense being played well maybe not no he is getting bursted down once again Duala doing a great job of keeping the heels flowing Duala 
been put into a sleep by the P the BM up there, nerf shot, making sure to keep the CCs going on the opposing team's heels, and that's probably what's doing a lot of the damage to Revert right now with his healer being CC'd so much. He's just taking so much damage. And they're trying to plan their burst out accordingly to bring him down at the right moment. Nephi taking a good a bit of damage right now. The physician heals on both sides is very substantial. They're just doing such a good job of keeping their team alive. As you can see, there's been it's a little bit of a stall in the action as each team is waiting for their cooldowns to come back up. Duala caged off to the side. Revert going down to about 40% health once again, but managed to get healed right back up. Lots of CCs going and Duala is sleeped once again. The Dom CCs are going like crazy. Squirrels everywhere. Duala being caged now. They're trying to control Duala and apply the pressure to revert, but Duala doing a great job of getting the heals flowing right as soon as the CC ends. Revert taking a lot of damage right now. Duala trying to move to where Revert isn't line of sighting him. Oh, the ma the cage once again. And Nephi caged as well. The two minute warning has been given so both teams are going to have to kick into high gear and try to get this win before time limit goes. Under the existing rules if neither team gets a kill before time limit is called both teams get a point. Oh, there is a death. Just as I was talking about it, somebody dies. And time is up. So it seems that the one death was on Team Testy Festy. So Team Warlord Sucks gets its second win. And the go has been given for both teams right now so let's see him charge in and ganked going right in and applying the cage to Duala. let's see if the pressure will be put on to revert or well let's see here it looked like Nephi is trying to target revert but Morg is doing a really good job of keeping the burst DPS from getting too crazy right now and a lot of DPS being applied to Nephi right now with Duala CC off to the side revert is taking a lot of damage once again Revert getting lots of DPS being applied to him. It's just trying to survive right now that he's being confronted with. He's constantly, oh, and he goes down. 
he was hovering around the 30% mark for so much of that time, and then it was just a matter of time if he didn't get the heels applied to him very well. And he was forced respawn, so he is most likely out of this match. He is out of this match, as a matter of fact. More getting DPS down right now, and wow. That was a heck of a match right there. Now, last but not least, Duala goes down. Alright, and the match is underway here. Let's see what the strategies are going to be this time. Is the focus going to be on to revert once again, or... Alright, they were trying to chase Gank there, but... Did a good job of getting away from him there. Duala CC'd right now. Morg taking a lot of damage. They're applying a lot of pressure to Morg right now. Gank doing a really good job of kiting at this moment. Morg trying to stick on him, but they're doing a lot of damage and a lot of CC to Morg. So pressuring Ganked is going to be a very hard task indeed. Duala is staying by the pillar so he can line a sight whenever he needs to, but it seems like he's CC'd right now, along with Revert being CC'd. Morg goes down to about 30% health for a moment there, but shot right back up. Once Duala's CC ended, the heals came very fast. And no, you, I don't think I've ever put break free in a macro, and I never will. Morg, his health bar went away, but he, yeah, he's still around the 50 to 60% health range. No, now he's back up. Duala staying behind the pillar, try, uh, tried to line a sight before the CC came at him, but unfortunately that did not work out, and Morg is dead right now. Duala got CC'd right at the right time, and Morg wasn't able to survive it. And they are saying they're GG's right now. As they believe the match is over. So that is a 4-0 sweep for Warlord Sucks. We've got our winners.